In this video, I'm going to be building every Olympic sport in LEGO. This is Bricky McBrickerson, and he's going to be competing in and testing out every Olympic sport. But first, of course, we need the opening ceremony where we light the Olympic torch and put on a giant performance. With that done, we can move on to the first sport, a staple for the Olympics, sprinting. I built this running track with four lanes and a giant finishing banner hanging over the finish line. But before he can race, he needs to grab himself some new kit. He picked himself up a new pair of shoes, running shorts, as well as a top, and now he's all decked out ready for the sprint. Bricky and his other competitors begin warming up on your marks get set and they're off bricky is speeding down the inside lane and claims a huge early victory in his first sport he's presented with his first medal and hopefully this will be the first of many to come i then put in some hurdles using this star wars blaster piece and this is going to be slightly more challenging than a regular running race again the referee fires they take off and the girl in the outside lane smashes into one of the hurdles but bricky and his compadres make it to the end and he finishes in a close second finishing second has got to hurt but maybe not quite as much as this lady is hurting right now boxing is up next and the round begins they both touch gloves and bricky lands a a few early body shots but then he's absolutely pummeled into the corner by his opponent he's really on the ropes here but he is saved by the bell his opponent is pretty confident that he can finish him off in the next round but bricky has determination and stands back up to begin round two straight away he fires back with a body shot of his own following with a few headshots and the overconfident opponent steps into one which ends up knocking him out and this is a huge win for bricky he's presented with another gold medal and i think after all those hits it's time for him to go into a more relaxing sport tennis. I built this tennis court adding nets down the middle and Bricky will be facing a pretty formidable opponent. She throws up the serve and the rally begins. Oh and that's a great shot from Bricky and he takes another gold medal. After his multiple victories it's now time for football. No not that kind of football, the real football. Yes, sir. I built a small pitch adding a penalty spot in front of the goal and the two teams are lined up ready to compete. We can see Bricky is representing the blue team, hopefully he'll put in a good performance. The referee blows a whistle and the game begins. There's some nice passing. Oh, and the blue team are in. Goal and the blue team take an early lead. But the Reds quickly strike back with a goal of their own and we're all tied up going into the latter stages of the game. Bricky's putting in a fantastic defensive performance and his blue team are on the attack. The ball is played through to Bricky in the box, but he's been fouled. The referee blows a whistle and she's awarded the penalty. She gives the player who committed the foul a red card and Bricky has a chance to win it all in the last minute. And of course, he puts it right in the top corner and his team are ecstatic. Back to the athletics next, as we have some more events for Bricky to take part in. Starting with javelin, shot put, and then I built this small sand pit for the long jump, with markers to see how far the athletes can make it. Bricky is up first and taking a nice long run up, he jumps, and he makes it a pretty good distance. The referee marks where he lands and now it's time for his opponent. She steps up sprinting with determination, jumps and flies past Bricky's record, leaving him only with a silver medal. Now we figured out that he can't jump very far, let's see how high he can jump. I built this adjustable bar for the high jump. Bricky steps up first and both him and his opponent clear the bar. The referees raise the bar. Again, both athletes clear this and the referees raise it one more time. But Bricky can't make it over and takes the bar out. All this guy has to do now is clear the bar and he wins gold. And he steps up and of course he does. Again, leaving Bricky with another silver. A slightly less classic Olympic sport next is golf. I built this green with a sand bunker, a small lake, and a hole at the end. So now enjoy this relaxing game of golf. It's safe to say the opponent took a pretty easy win and Bricky was left splashing around trying to find his ball. But speaking of balls, volleyball is up next and I built a small sand court, adding this net using Lego net pieces, which might be a little bit too large, but either way the game began. Oh, and she misses the ball and Bricky's team take the win. So this year in 2024, France are hosting the Olympics and they were meant to be swimming in the River Seine. However, the French weren't sure if they would be able to clean the river enough. So I built a pool as a backup. The swimmers lined up and the race began. Is there any limit to what Bricky can't do? Well, I added this diving board and his opponent showed him how it's done with this elegant flip. Bricky is a little bit scared of heights and it's safe to say he won't be scoring well for that dive. Another water sport is surfing, and Bricky's friend Surfmaster Harry gave him a few tips before heading out to show him how it's done. Harry's tearing up on the waves, and he even added in some flips, pulling off some cool tricks which scored very well with the judges. He surfed in, giving Bricky the board, who paddled out and managed to catch one wave before it all went horribly wrong. Now let's speed run through a few more sports, starting with archery, basketball, yeah this took me a lot of shots to pull off, rugby where Bricky got smashed, 
just like how you should smash the subscribe button if you're enjoying this video right now. Break dancing, yes, this is a real Olympic sport. Canoeing, shooting. Gymnastics, which has various different forms, including this one on the high bars. And now it's time for Bricky to perform a show of strength in weightlifting. The athletes all did a little warm up before Bricky was paired with his first opponent. Both of them managed to get this first weight up easily. Two plates moved pretty well. But his opponent failed on the next weight. And Bricky just about managed to pull this up, advancing him to the final. He stepped up to the plate to see who he was facing in the final and looked over and saw Michael the Mountain. I don't think he stands a chance. Bricky was up first and as much as he struggled, he couldn't get the weight up. But this was no trouble for Michael, who easily claimed gold. There are various different martial arts in the Olympics, so Bricky went and got changed into his robes and proceeded to get absolutely pummeled by his opponent. I'm pretty sure he must have stolen that black belt because he definitely doesn't deserve it. Horse riding is up next and more specifically dressage. This is where a rider and their horse perform a routine and get scored by the judges. Him and his opponent stepped up to greet the judges. She went first performing a lovely routine. Showing masterful control of the horse and getting an overall pretty great score. Bricky then put his cowboy hat on but sadly he isn't a very good horse rider and that looked like it hurt. I don't think horse riding is for him either. Skateboarding on the other hand is an epic sport, so I had to do it justice by building this giant skate park. It has lots of ramps, rails, small jumps and even a bowl in the corner. Bricky made sure to put on his helmet for extra safety before grabbing his skateboard and heading to start his run. He performed a ton of awesome tricks and had a load of fun carving around the park. Cycling again has lots of different subgenres, beginning with BMX, where we're back in the skate park, this time on a bike. The road race was next, and Bricky was heading to the finish line. He goes for the overtake and clutches the win. Finally over to the velodrome where you soak around this giant curved circle. Finally Bricky has to face his fear of heights as he's tackling climbing. I built a wall with an easy, medium and hard route. He got suited up with all the protective gear and easily scaled the first course. Making the medium course look pretty good too. However, failing on his final attempt on the hard line and failing miserably. If you could try any of these Olympic sports, let me know which one you'd pick in the comments down below. And if you enjoyed, make sure to hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.